honey. I didn't do that. Go ahead, kids. Don't forget the spelling test tomorrow. Not you. Come over here. Sit down and get comfy. You're going to be here for a while. But I didn't do it, I swear. No? Then who did? Don't even think about it. No toys. Head down. Spend so much. Nate, what do you want for dinner tonight? Hamburgers. I'm not hungry. Well, if neither of you are hungry, I just got a text asking me to take an extra shift tonight. So, Molly, I'll need you to stay home and watch Nate. What? Why do you have to do I don't want to be stuck with him. Come on, guys. Is it such torture to spend an evening together? Yes. yes. Why can't you hire a babysitter? Because we're on a budget. If I spend money on a sitter, we won't have money for things like art supplies or a new dress for the dance. I need that dress, Mom. It's like life or death. Bedtime's at nine. And Molly, I need you to make dinner later and actually spend some time with your brother. Don't stay holed up in your bedroom all night. Fine. Ow! She kicked me! I'm sure it was an accident. Sure, it wasn't. I think Mom's been punished enough. Can't we go back downstairs? What do you want from me? Oh, I would like you to apologize to your brother Nate for destroying his art pencils. No. Oh. Well, fine. I will just make it and so you can't touch anybody else's things at all. How about that? like that. I'm sure she's sorry. She is sorry because she's being punished. She is not sorry for anything that she did to you. I have never, ever seen a young woman who's so rude. The parents should be ashamed. They should be punished, too. Y you mean my mom? But, but she didn't do anything. Exactly. She let Molly torment you. Now, let's see. What color are your mother's eyes? No, you can't punish my mom. I do not abide that tone from young men. Now go and get a photograph of her before she gets back. And she and I are going to have a little talk about parenting, aren't we? <laughs> So 
disappointed in you. I want you to leave my family alone. Not until they have experienced the cruelty that they put you through. You're way meaner than Molly ever was. Maybe you need some punishing. Are you mouthing off at me? Do you know, I think I could live without a mouth like that. And I think so could you. Ow! 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 No! Hush, 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 hush. You're going to disturb the neighbors, and that would be discourteous, wouldn't it? Now, this may pinch just a little bit. She's going to cut off my tongue. What do I do? I don't know. There's nothing you can do except learn to live without it. You'll be able to talk, but you'll sound really peculiar. Please, please don't. No. Oh. There's a picture I could get used to. Nate is an amazing artist. I know. The things he draws look so real. Sometimes I think they could just come alive. 